And uh, you did cosplay once as Gary Oak from Pokemon. How did yes. that come about? And anything in particular you want to uh, mention about that costume? Uh, he's my favorite Pokemon character because he's like, if you follow the Pokemon show, like Ash is the worst protagonist of all time. <laughs> Cause he doesn't, he, he sets out to be a Pokemon master and then he catches like five. Half of them he doesn't even catch, he just befriends. Which I think is cool, you know, it's cute, but... Gary Oak was the man. Gary Oak got all the gym badges first. He had like the best team. He had the bigger, the bigger crabby than Ash, you know. <laughs> Gary Oak, that was, that was the man. Uh, he was so good at training Pokemon that he, he had to move on to being a researcher. And I thought, I was like, this is the guy who should be the main character. Right here, this guy's got a, he's like 14 years old and he's got a convertible full of cheerleaders. So I want to be that guy. So that was, uh, I always thought he was the coolest. And I love Pokemon, you know, Pokemon was a, another game that I had played like since my childhood, like all the time. Pokemon Blue version. That was the one I played, I played right. Play blue version because it had Blastoise on it. So, and the the costume itself, anything in particular? Was that relatively straightforward when you're doing uh, someone who is ostensibly kind of a, a supposed to be a, a normal person type character? Yeah, it's it, it. I love costumes like that because it's you can Amazon most of it. For Gary, all I had to make was the necklace, strapping on the boots, and then he has like a bi uh, an orange bias at the bottom of his shirt. But uh, for that one, I, I did. I made his badge case where he has uh, all he has 12 badges in a region that only has eight. Uh, so I, I had the badge case open up and it had 12 badges. I thought that was uh, fun. And then his wig was uh, he's got a very big anime hairstyle, which was you know took a little time to style, but it's deceptively simple. And simple cosplays can be harder because if you have a complex cosplay and you miss a few details, no one's going to notice unless they're really nitpicking you. But if you have a simple cosplay and you miss a few details, it's going to be like very glaringly obvious. So you know, you want to pay closer attention to those simple ones.